What you're looking at here are the upcoming Intel Nova Lake S lineup, and that's according to a leak that is on X here. I will link you to this as well as this article. So let's go through these supposed rumored CPUs. I'm not sure how concrete all of this is, so take it with a grain of salt. Remember, if you're enjoying my content, you can do everything that's up here. Like, share, subscribe. Remember to hit that notification bell and of course, comment. So these range from 12 to 52 cores. You've got the Core Ultra 9 with 16P cores, 32 E cores, 4 LPE cores, 150 watts. You've got the Core Ultra 7, 14 P cores, 24 E cores, as well as 4 LPE cores, again, 150 watts. The next three here are Ultra 5s. Both of these have 8 P cores. This one here varies one has 16 e cores the other one has 12 e cores but you have the same here same 125 watts plus this one also has 125 watts but this one is well on the lower end here six p cores and only eight e cores and we have got two ultra threes here four p cores eight E cores, as well as four LPE cores, 65 watts. This one is also 65 watts. However, it varies when it comes to the E cores. It only has four. Now, I'm not sure when actually these will be released. Probably at the end of 2025 in the fourth quarter. We don't know, but it will apparently require a new socket. So a whole bunch of uh, new motherboards, I suppose which might be a good thing. Who knows? Is this Intel's chance to shine again? Now, this video is not over yet because I'm going to go through actually what P cores, E cores, and LP cores are because maybe you don't know. So P cores are, say it together now, if you know, performance cores, and E cores are efficiency cores, and LP cores are low power cores. That's what they are. So when you hear someone talking about P cores and E cores and LP cores, you'll be able to tell them exactly what is going on. And by the way, Intel is also planning to include hyper-threading support in these next generation CPUs. So who knows? Intel might shine like a diamond and might be shining like a diamond at the end of 2025 and possibly be beautiful like diamonds in the sky in 2026.